In the new year, besides greetings, parties, we are certain that new year resolutions will remain a mainstay of your plans. Some will join the gym, some will work on personal growth, while some others may target professional growth this year. But have you ever wondered what resolutions do nations take at the time of the new year? Let's find cues to the question. In the new year greetings coming in from different countries, starting with China where a surge in COVID cases has marred the new year enthusiasm, hence overcoming the COVID challenge and the challenges of the economy and jobs emanating from this remains the top priority resolution for China. Chinese President Xi Jinping has said the light of hope is right in front of us. Let's now look at Russia, the country that waged the first major war in Europe in over 75 years. It has resolved to win this war in 2023. Moving across the Mediterranean, European countries are resolving to shed off side effects of the Ukraine war. On these lines, Germany has resolved to gain energy independence this year in the face of dwindling supplies from Russia. Die und die dafür nötigen Leitungen haben unsere Ingenieurinnen und Facharbeiter in nicht einmal 200 Tagen gebaut. Schon in den kommenden Wochen und Monaten gehen weitere Flüssiggasterminals in Betrieb in Lubmin, in Stade, in Brunsbüttel. Damit machen wir unser Land und Europa dauerhaft unabhängig von russischem Gas. Und zugleich kommen wir so durch diesen Winter. Übrigens auch dank gut gefüllter Gasspeicher und weil wir gemeinsam in den vergangenen Monaten Energie eingespart haben. Meanwhile, British Prime Minister Rishi Sunak has cautioned against the challenges awaiting the country in 2023. He said 2022 was tough and the UK's problems are not going to go away in 2023. He has nonetheless promised that his government would put people's priorities first. Mr. Speaker, he talks about mandates, about votes, about elections. It's a bit rich coming from the...